what is your clan name? We are the Feathered, feathered Boas. Boas. The Feathered Boas, very nice. Yes. Uh, you, you wander into the carnival, you see before you the following zones. The food, the, uh, the food stand, the test of strength midway, the Ooh. ticket booth Ooh. for various rides, an animatronic fortune teller, and dun dun dun, the fun house. No! Oh my gosh. Oh my. Who wants to go first? And where do you want to go? Oh, the pain! Oh, a two! A two! Do, do, do. One of the midway barkers catches your attention because of the peculiar because of the peculiar way in which he's barking. It's less like a salesman and more like a dog. Or a wolf. Or a werewolf! <laughs> this is what he is. You're fighting a werewolf barker. Oh my goodness. Our bow tie. We've got to poke it up. Come on, tie. Tie. kind of come on in. Poke a head in here. See who it is. Who is it? Oh, you right yeah, we've oh, we've got somebody. All right. You guys gotta wait. Okay. Oh no. I'll be back. All right. You are fighting a werewolf barker. It has one hit point, and uh, you get to stand on that first line. You have three attempts to hit him. Uh, first line as in number one. As in number one. I, I'm really sorry, guys. Okay, <laughs> somebody take my. I assume I can't throw the turtle at him. You can't throw the turtle. Dang I'm sorry. it! Oh, so close! Arr, I'm a werewolf. Uh, ah! oh, oh, I'm sorry. All right. Does somebody else wish to attempt to fight the werewolf barker? I can attempt. So that counts as one adventure. So for the day. I guess I need my pen. Thanks for paying attention. So you are day one. One day one adventure has been spent. One of my two. Criminy. Here. <laughs> that was pointless. Ha, this'll do it. Alright. She's not <laughs> Somebody else, uh, do you wish to adventure somewhere else? Uh, yeah. Do you you can go to the midway again if you want and try for a different adventure, or you can try and fight the werewolf again. Or I can burp. I'm sorry, excuse me. I'll try and fight the werewolf. Alright. I'll take it. Pass take off the accoutrements. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Your dark sir, the first line, if you please. Those cans of beer look awfully heavy. Wouldn't you like me to give you some assistance in holding them? Well, yep. I reckon he gives you a can of beer. Cool. <laughs> Two. 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 You walk up to the concession stand to buy some cotton candy, but just your luck, it comes to life and tries to attack you. Thankfully, it's humongous. Uh, again. Again with the cotton candy. And she's a turtle tamer. A turtle tamer. Against the cotton candy. First line. Oh, thank you. All right. Give that cotton candy. Yay! Woo! Good job. Yeah. All right. You win two. Cut some meat into the slot, and a car drops into the tray uh -huh. at the bottom. This is the other one. In five minutes, it says you will be attacked by a guy with a knife. Crap. Hey, look, it's a guy with a knife. Five minutes later, right on the dot. Wow. <laughs> What class are you going to sir? Pops doesn't matter. Sir. First line. <laughs> One hit point. Show that guy with a knife what for. Or what two. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh, hey! Right in the ow! Uh, oh, and then a knife! Nice. Uh, <laughs> right ooh, you get a sharp knife. Ooh. And two of them, because it's day two. Better off grabbing one at a time, because it's hard to it's hard to tell All right. how I feel. They're, they're light and on top. Light and on top. All right, one white rabbit and one black rabbit. So, summoning circle. Sorry. Number three. All right. This is. This keeps happening. So. <laughs> What we are going to do is we are going to play a game of the mastermind. Well, narratively, what happens is a <laughs> demon, a very, uh, a very attractive female demon, pops up in the middle of the circle, if that's your thing, and says, you want a date? Well, you're going to have to guess my phone number. Ah. It starts with 666. Not that that's relevant at all. It's just a joke. <laughs> Four-digit phone number. 
So what you'll do is you will write down four digits. I will tell you how many of them you have correct and in the correct position, and how many of them you have correct but in the wrong position. And you have 12 guesses. It's, it's pointless. That's not even her real number, because no numbers start with 666. I she know. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously, Obviously, it's a con. I'm not sure if it's a riddle. It's a trick. All right. Well, let's start with... One, two, three, and four. All right. Two in the correct position, none wrong. Okay. None wrong? None right in the None in the incorrect position. Sorry. Oh, okay. Got it. All right. Then we will do... There's three in the correct position and one in the incorrect position. Stop it. <laughs> Five and six. Ha. Is actually you're doing this pretty quickly. All right. And, uh, five and seven. Okay. So eight. Can we help him? You can. Say one, two, seven, six. All right. Yay! Yay. <coughs> 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 Either that or KO players are just really good at math. <laughs> well, <laughs> really good at math problems. Well, starting starting with one, two is. Um, yeah, that makes it easy. Yeah. That's true. Also, obviously, a fake phone number. Because <laughs> no pretty girl has a number. Starts with one, two, eight. Yeah. Well, you do get a date. It's probably delicious. All right. Food to adventure. Wow.